What's up travelers, Case here. If you're new to this channel, I post weekly videos every Friday to help take you away from the everyday stresses of life, even if just for a little bit. Usually this will take the form of comedy. So if that sounds like something that you'd be interested in, feel free to become a traveler at any moment by clicking that subscribe button and hitting that notification bell. So for the longest time, I've been wanting to share one of my favorite comedians with you guys. Unfortunately, I've been unable to do this because I've seen most of his acts already. Well, I finally found an act that I haven't seen. Today, I'll be reacting to Bill Burr's old man face skit. If you don't know who Bill Burr is, you're gonna learn today. He's a hilarious comedian who's been in the game for quite some time, and recently, he's been starting to get the recognition that he deserves. So, let's just get right into the video. This is my Bill Burr old man face reaction. Anyways, like I mentioned, I'm 41 years old. If I'm lucky, you know what I realize? I'm halfway through my shit right now. Halfway through my life. So, you know, I'm getting nervous, you know, about dying, you know, just growing old, man. I was never really nervous about it until I got to this age and I, you know, you know what it was? I went to my grandmother's 100 year birthday party. And I quickly realized that women age a lot better towards the end. You know, guys, we hang with them in the beginning because we're young, <laughs> and then in the middle they're having kids, so we kind of pass them, but that end, that last third, we're like the stock market. We just, we just go right down to the ground. It's brutal. I went to this party. All the old ladies there were unbelievably shocked. They were still playing cards. They were right there. But some of the old dudes, man, they, they were brutal. You know, you ever see a guy like so old he has like that permanent look of horror on his face? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, dude, how much pain are you in that you constantly have a look on your face like that shit from the ring just <laughs> Dude, that's gotta be, you're like so old, like everything hurts. You're just standing up like, ah! <laughs> you gotta lean on something, ah! Oh my God! <laughs> Even like blinking, like air hurts, <laughs> Dang. I told her to think about killing myself twice a week at this age. There is no fucking way I'm going out like that. In my life, I'm walking around. Everyone else has that panic. Oh, fuck, is it going? I don't know how you do it. How do you wake up every morning brushing your teeth? How do you fight the urge? Because I just jam my You know, just like, <laughs> <laughs> like, I was going to go to Europe, but they never got around to it. Uh, <laughs> but only the old guys had like that. <laughs> Dude, it was almost like they wanted to tell you a secret. <laughs> like, where's the gold? <laughs> Make sure you're there at two. You were there at two at two the other day. And she's very happy. I love you his, were, uh, you were 
his voice, like, you know how, like, comedians have certain verses? Alright, let me pause that. Uh, so I love his voice that he does for, like, other characters, like, uh, when he does, like, female voices and stuff like that. It, it's so awesome, like, I love how comedians, when they tell a story, they'll they'll use other voices to represent other characters. A lot of comedians have other voices, like one of my one of my favorite comedians, well, another one of my favorite comedians is um, Fluffy, uh, Gabriel Iglesias. He's, he's really funny. If you haven't checked out him, you should definitely check him out as well. But he has a lot of voices and he also does other sounds. Like, he'll, he'll put you in a story because of all the sounds that he does and it's, it's really funny. But I love when comedians do other voices it really puts you in to the uh, to the skit, you know? It, it makes you feel like, you know, you're in it. It's funnier when you can really get into the scenario, you know? And that's what I really love when they do the voices because it really puts you in the action, so. No, you never leave with an uppercut. You set it up with a jab, you get inside, you come right up through the cleavage, you rock that head back, you set it right across the linoleum, Next to him. Wipe off the door handle. Fuck with you. Wipe off the door handle. You're gonna get caught. You're gonna go to jail. You're gonna get raped. It's off. You know you're What do you do now? What are you gonna do now? Right? You're married, right? You can't yell because your kids are there. You can't go for a drive. You don't have a cool car anymore. You know, like some caravan with those children in the corn handprints all over the windshield. Ball stickers. What do you do? You go down in the basement. You just do like that whisper yelling. Oh, oh damn. <laughs> and then I think just one day you, you're just too old. You're just too old. You're tired. You've been married like 60 years. Your body's breaking down. You blew your knee out at the Y playing pickup ball like 30 years earlier in the 50 and older league, you know? And you just want to watch the game. And she comes in that one last time, right? Just to annoy you. Yeah. Just picking on you. Yeah, you always mean to my mother. And I always resented your throat. But the day before was the last day you had the quad strength to get up and out of your favorite chair. And that's when the panic sets in. You're like, oh shit. Dude, I can't get up. Oh my god. I gotta listen to this for the rest of my life. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, that's Oh, 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 no! <laughs> that, was, that was great. That was so funny. I love Bill Burr. He's so amazing. He, he's really funny. Really funny, dude. This this was a really funny one. He has a lot of other really funny ones. This one was really good, though. Yeah, I haven't seen this one. This one's pretty great. I love how he not only explained why he feels like these older men have this look of horror on their faces, but he actually took you into the whole scenario, like, of why, like, broke it down and everything and it was just amazing that was that was really funny i i really love bill burr you should definitely check out more of his stuff because bill burr he's like a legend and i just wish that i hadn't have seen most of his stuff already because then i could show you guys more of it but you should definitely check out more of bill burr he's hilarious and he has a lot of really funny material this one was up there but he has some that like you know like You'll be cracking up the whole time. Hands down, one of the funniest dudes I've ever seen. So you should definitely check him out. Bill Burr is amazing. So, I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, don't forget to smash the like button. Question of the day, who's your favorite comedian? Post your answers in the comments below. If you're not already subscribed, consider clicking that subscribe button because then you'll be informed about new videos. And if you do, don't forget to click that notification bell so you never miss a video. Real quick, I wanted to give a big shout out to the YouTube channel, Call of the Mild. The guy who runs the channel is a really awesome dude, super genuine. He recently came out with a video titled, Dirty Pickup Lines, which for those of you that have been traveling with me on the Life's Amazing Journey channel for some time, you know that a while back, I posted a similar video. 
Well, he actually mentioned me in the video as his inspiration for the video, and I wanted to say thank you for that. I'm honored. He posts challenges, reactions, and just all around fun content. So if that sounds like something you'd be interested in, check out his channel and maybe click the subscribe button. Oh, looks like I still need to subscribe. So yeah, call the mild, awesome guy. So that's going to conclude this week's video. Until next time, I'm officially Case, and I'm officially signing off. Peace out everyone.